what's up guys welcome back to my channel naturally me Dion here again now if you're new to this channel be sure that you subscribe to the channel okay because if you want to see any makeup tips hair tips whatever you want to see you can see all things beauty here I hope to see you guys again and thank you so much for coming back if you guys already seen videos from me but you haven't subscribed yet Welcome back. I hope to see you subscribe the next time you watch one of my videos, okay? So today, what we're going to do, I'm going to run through because I got some stuff to do, girl. I got things to do. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. Now, I do have this um, subscription from BoxyCharm, all right? So this is my new subscription that I started doing. And um, this subscription here is called Sweet Treats. And it looks like this. Girl, just make you want to eat all that candy, all right? Let me tell you, everything I have right here, um, I already took it out. So, um, I have the Icy Sherbet Primer, and I'm definitely going to try this. I want to see what this here is about. Now, look here. I'm not trying to get y'all to buy anything. No, this is a subscription that I decided to get because I thought it was fun because I'm constantly buying makeup, and I love buying makeup. But I also like talking to you guys, you know, because I know I got some beginners in makeup that's probably watching these videos. I thought maybe this would be a good subscription for you, even if you don't know what to buy. It gives you a chance to try out new things, you know, without spending so much money just yet. I mean, what about it? I mean, and then you got cold. COVID, you know, but everything is coming down. I think it's already gone. But anyway, uh, everything is calmed down. So you guys can kind of walk in the store and look for things yourself. But just in case you don't know what to look for, this is a nice subscription that you can kind of like go and like just not even go to the store, especially if you work a lot, you travel a lot. They have like a lot of nice things or whatnot that you like any skin concerns that you guys have. And you can just kind of like, you know, um, tell them what you like and what you don't like. And they'll send that subscription to you once a month if you're into that okay now I also have this vitamin C mask okay and this is the way that look it's Giorgio something Georgia Kingler vitamin C mask and this here says it's for all skin types um now this is a mask so I'm definitely not gonna put this on right now but I just want to show you guys the skincare that is in this. Now, I really like masks. I like the fact that this comes in a pump. Now, I will be using this, and maybe I will put this in, like, an empty video or something, um, whatnot. Now, some of the products that I'm getting here that I might not use, I don't know, but probably give it away in, like, a giveaway or something if I don't use it because a lot of these products, I, I already have so much products. So, I just thought it would be pretty dope to get a subscription, you know, so I can build up a basket or something for my girls, you know, just in case, you know. So, also, I have this Dragon Lash um, mascara. So, let's see what this looks like. Everybody loves mascara, girl. Everybody loves some mascara. So, look at that. Move you guys here. She's like this lady on here. It's pretty tight. So, this is the way that looks. So, take this out. I really like the way this looks. This looks nice. It looks crazy. Look at it. It got like these. It looks like dragon fire or something going on. It's pretty dope. I think this is hot. This kind of give me like a Kevin D feel. Okay. So, and also I have this Natasha um, palette here. And this is the way that looks. So, I'm definitely going to use this today. And I think this is really, you know, beginner friendly. You know what I'm saying? This is like a really beginner friendly box to me. All right. And I also have these tweezers here. All right. As you guys see. And everything that I don't talk about, guys, or show you guys, I'm going to put it in the description. But I'm definitely showing you everything that comes in this box. All right. So, we not to make this video long because everybody know. You know what I'm saying? Look. All right. So, so first off, what I'm going to do, I already washed my face. So, I'm going to use um, this Icy uh, Sherbet Primer. All right. It looks like this. And when you take it out the box, I really like this matte looking pink. You know what I'm saying? I really like that. Most of the time when you see pink um, products with a brand, 9 times out of 10, it gives you hydration. But the way this looks... Let me show you. Take the seal off. So the way this looks, it looks like it will not only hydrate your skin, but it looks like it'll give you that like mattifying, like it'll give you that blur effect. So I like the blur effect when it, oh, it smells, 
so good. It kind of smells like roses, but it's like a perfume scent. So if you got sensitive skin, this is probably not for you, but I have sensitive skin, so I probably tell you. So I'm going to say this just for the sake of this video. If you guys don't like things that smell, I love things that smell that is good for my sensitive skin. I really do because I love stuff smell good. I don't mind it being on my face just as long as it don't irritate me, you know what I'm saying? So you might be interested in this after I use it, so let me tell you what I think because I pretty much know what I like the first time I tried. Okay, so I'm just going to put a little of this on. It feels very cooling too. I like that. I'm gonna rub this in. You guys, in my hand, yeah, I, my wrist is open and girl, it hurts, okay? And I do not like this ugly thing on my hand, but I can't help myself right now, okay? So yeah, y'all understand. Work with me, girl, work with me. So I'm just gonna bring this down my neck. It really feels nice. Really nice to blend and easy to blend into the skin I do feel like it's hydrating my skin a lot okay <laughs> and I think this is really this would have been really good for me throughout the winter now the summertime I don't know but I'm definitely gonna be using it and let you guys see how I like but I can always use a good primer girl because I love to prime before I paint it baby okay we gotta prime it before we paint it girl really like the way it feels really nice and like hydrating not too much hydration but just enough so let's go into the foundation that i'm going to use we don't really talk about what foundation it is i'm just going to put that on because like i told y'all i got stuff to do this morning but first before i even put my primer on i need to go ahead and do these brows right quick let's go ahead and sway her to the gourds so I'm always finding ways to change up the way I do my brows just to make the process easier. So that's one thing that I want to tell you guys. I'm always doing my brows different. Like it's kind of like you do your brows whatever way is easier for you. Like I'm always trying to find shortcuts to do it, but I still want my brows to be slay. You know what I'm saying? Um, I really like the defined look. You know what I'm saying? But the defined look oftentimes make it looks like you've been in a mirror all day working on those so i don't want to get that impression i want to always like make it seem like hey it ain't take me long <laughs> you know what i'm saying so yeah but it's nothing like giving that real defined look like and get it done quick but now when you're when you're doing your brows um it's it's never gonna be as quick 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 like it's no shortcut it's kind of like whatever you feel that's best at that time whatever you like you know what i'm saying the more dramatic you like the longer it takes and that's the truth i like to just think about those things too oftentimes when i do my brows like how can i find a way to do dramatic brows quickly well there's no quick way to do a dramatic brow okay because you got to use enough products to get what you need on them brows okay that's the truth so if you be like, I can't get my brows done like that, just take your time and, you know, find out, just learn the structure of your brows and find out, you know what I'm saying, what works for you. Don't do everything you see. I mean, if you like, if this idea works for you the way I'm doing my brows, try it, you know. But I kind of always keep my brow um, pomade nearby, even when I've already done, just in case I need to kind of like touch up something you guys want to know the brushes that i'm using in this video i am using a lot of um real technique brushes i'm using um the tweezer man okay love the tweezer man brush i want to own one i hate that want to own more but because the tweezer man brushes are very nice okay so i'm just gonna take the concealer on at the top and just in case this video may be a tad bit too fast for you, you guys can always comment down below, okay? And let me know, like, do you, what do you need to see details of? And that one thing about that way is it's real easy for me to kind of see what you guys need to see. And I can put those videos out, okay? Because if you don't tell me, it's like I'm fighting against something I don't know. So just kind of tell me what you guys want to see if you want to work on anything, you know? And I can kind of bring that to you. And I do need more than one person telling me what to what video to make. You know what I'm saying? So if I get more than 
you know, just one person saying the same thing, I'm going to definitely bring that video to you. I'm not going to lie and say, if one person tell me I'm going to make it, no, I need more than one person because <laughs> this takes time. You know what I'm saying? Editing videos and putting them out there. It really, it really does take time. Um, however, I don't mind it, but definitely we have to have standards guys. We need more than one person telling a person what to do. And if you don't tell me, then you'll never see the video. Let's be real. I'm just do it the way I've been doing it. Just get through. <laughs> so yeah, I'm a, I'm a teacher in the spirit. So I just kind of think that, you know what I'm saying? If you want to see something, you got to tell a person because a closed mouth does not get fed. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is go back into my tweezer man brush kind of blend everything in from this way all right so now guys what I'm gonna do and this just a habit after finishing my brows so now what I'm gonna definitely do is go into a powder because I need my face I have a feeling that my face might get a little bit of moisture so I don't want that so I'm definitely gonna set before I use a foundation but I'm not gonna do too much I'm gonna use my Fendi powder I'll dip a brush in there tap it a little bit you know like that okay and i'm gonna just put place it in my oily areas you know and set it'll be great to set that concealer as well so it won't budge split that's what i would like to do you know i kind of do this often because i learned that it, it preserves the look longer especially if you have oily skin you don't want them all sneaking out of this, this when you um doing that makeup, you know, you throughout the day, you know how those all sneak up on you. Now it might sneak on you a little bit, but it won't be too bad. So that's why I like setting with a powder before I even apply my foundation. And I mean this step can be done even like if you're doing a um if you're using like um if you're doing color correcting, you need to use it after you finish with your color correcting and set that too so that that can be still in one place you know you won't be like leaking or whatnot you know they won't kind of split up separate from your sis that's what i'm saying and moving on i'm gonna go ahead and jump into my foundation now whatever one i figure out i'm using okay so what i have on my desk here right now is the estee lauder double wear and this is the rich chestnuts uh 5c1 all right love estee lauder estee lauder it's cool you know what i'm saying so yeah i got so many foundations that i love like i like to just try a lot of different foundations and however this has been one that stuck with me for a while i don't mind it at all it's liquidy you know what i'm saying and it's like it don't come out much really thick it's more so liquid you know what i'm saying i'm like gosh and if you you don't need a lot of estee lauder okay so when you wear estee lauder you don't need a lot just need a little bit okay because it's it's very much so full coverage it's not gonna move okay girl you can be talking on the phone it's still there honey okay so i'm just gonna put a little bit of this on it don't take a lot because it's real good for coverage okay so if you use this foundation i noticed that when you put too much on it will look caked up it will look make you look kind of cakey if you use too much so you know just a disclaimer if you guys are using this foundation i really like it but don't it don't take much okay So I think that's about it. That's all that I'm going to use because I think that's pretty much enough. Don't want to like be real dramatic today. Today ain't the day I want to be dramatic. Because let me tell you, girl, let me tell you, I love doing makeup. But if I'm not going nowhere, I can't stand to keep it on. And I don't, I don't really like to put it on if I'm not doing anything. That's what making it so hard, guys, for me to do YouTube videos. Because even though I'm a professional at this thing, it's not something that, you know what I'm saying, I will sit there and do every day. Like, you will have to tell me because it's like, you know when a person know they're good at what they do? You know what I'm saying? You're going to have to tell them what to do if you need to be helped in a situation in certain things. And that's just me, and I'm going to be real. All right? I do makeup too much to be winning all the time. If I have to, you know what I'm saying, do makeup all day and come here and make a video and y'all only give me like 55 views, I'm going to be mad for real. 
So I just rather not do makeup unless you guys tell me. But I'm happy to go. On, I'm happy to be going somewhere, so I don't mind it today. So I'm only really gonna do makeup on myself when I'm going somewhere. That's it. Like I'm just not gonna randomly give you guys a makeup tutorial. No, cause it's too much time. You know what I'm saying? It's it, it's this costs money and time to make YouTube videos, and people think that it's really easy. You can do this thing overnight. No, I've been doing this for a long time. Okay, and you have to crawl before you can walk, and I'm still crawling. Anyway, I just learned to not really give, just care anymore about just putting it out there i just do it when i feel like it because at the same time i don't want to waste time you know what i'm saying i do have a cosmetic line that i'm working on and that i got you know i gotta make sure i put down orders and put in orders or uh, make sure i ship products so it takes a lot of time to really make these videos so that's what i'm saying so if you guys don't tell me what to do then it's kind of it's weird to get on here and just give y'all a random video you know what i'm saying so you guys have to respond to me if you guys like my content so i can give you guys what you want you know what i'm saying because it's it's, it's like there's nothing in the world that's worse than putting something out there when a person don't need it okay youtube is to help people okay not to just sit here and just be making random videos no it's to help like and that's why i make the videos because i want to help you know what i'm saying like i don't have to do that like i can make videos about random stuff talking and that's pretty much what's finna happen <laughs> making random videos because at the end of the day about real life Okay, because let me tell you, it's like too much time and I'm just getting tired of it. You know what I'm saying? I love YouTube, don't get me wrong, but I'm getting tired of just putting stuff out there and nobody watching. Like, seriously. Like, you guys want to see stuff that I don't even like to do. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> at the end of the day, hey, if you want to see makeup tutorials, you're going to have to bring it. Or else, you guys just going to go on this health journey with me. Okay, because boo, your girl is going to get snatched on you. Okay, because I ain't going to just be making them. I ain't lying, I ain't doing that no more. Cause um these people be wasting my time. I don't care, I'm just being real. You're wasting my time. I don't wanna sit here and be doing makeup just to be doing. I got too much makeup to be wasting. This stuff ain't cheap. Uh, and I buy everything I get. You know, I spend money. So at the end of the day, why give you something and y'all ain't giving me shit? Okay, anyway. So Keep moving on. You feel me? If you're in your feelings, unsubscribe. I don't give a damn. It's real. But anyway, tap, tap, tap. This is what I'm doing to my concealer. <laughs> Live your best life, lady. It's going to be 2022 coming in. I'm living like 2020, 2020, 2020, It's already in the building, okay? <laughs> For real. We ain't got time to be making videos that people don't need. No. Shoot, if you don't watch it, I don't get paid. So why waste my time? I want to go where the money is. I'm going to where the money is. My money is the cosmetics, so that's what I'm sticking to. So when y'all start responding, y'all will see more makeup. I see what you got like. I break it to you. Simple. So anyways, that's just the way it go. Time is money, and I got too much working for me to be sitting here doing one thing, you know? That's why I had to get this subscription box, because y'all weren't saying that. <laughs> <laughs> just to keep it in because I love makeup. I live for makeup. But ain't nobody finna be up on this thing for free. No. One thing that I like about light colors like this, so you guys get a palette with this color in there, you might be like, what am I gonna do with that color? Well, you can always put that on as a base before, like to set up, your, set your concealer or whatnot. And then you can just use a darker color after that to help that color pull that darker color even more. So if you ever wonder like why do they put these light colors in here like that like why do all of, that's why because sometimes you need a little extra grip okay so now I'm gonna go into this like brown using that same brush but it looks like it's not brown it looks more black I don't like that because it's not really true to its color anyway let's keep moving so I'm just gonna blend this in I'm not going to use a lot. I'm not dipping it no more because it's very pigmented. And it's definitely looked like it's black and not the brown that I see in this palette. But that's okay because a lot of palettes are like that. It doesn't, it's not a big deal to me. I can always make it work. 
okay so i did that want to use these colors here but i don't know what to expect because i didn't really like the way everything else came out with this palette so this is the sheer color that's there which is here and this is the other sheer color so must i say only color that i really like in this palette is that brown but it's not really a brown it's like black it's like a dark ash black so it's not actually my favorite palette from boxy charm but that's okay now i think i want to go into like probably this gold or this sheer color here just want to go into that kind of make like a, a halo All right, so now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna, you don't have to do this, but um, I think, well, this little kid don't give me like a liner, so I'm not gonna do a liner. What I'm gonna do is use this lash product, Dragon Lash, but I am gonna put um, lashes on today. So, and this is the way that it looks when you open it up. Now, this dragon lash is pretty bomb, ladies. Let me tell you right now. I mean, just, it don't take long to get what you want with this. I like that. It's small enough to get into the corner of the eye. And it's really getting the lash, like, straighten it up. You know what I'm saying? Like. It's making my lashes kind of curl. Now what I'm going to do is go ahead and kind of remove this powder from my face. And I like to go like this first. So guys, and now that I'm finished with my makeup, I am going to talk to you guys about what I got from boxy charm because that's what this video is about you know to show you guys some new stuff that i got and maybe you guys be interested in getting something from boxy charm because it's really good okay okay sometime because this time like last time i liked that box way better than i like this box i don't know what this was but i would not buy this in real life <laughs> So, yeah, I thank God for Boxy Charm showing me that I want to purchase this. So, anyway, since this is the one I pick up, and um, this is the this is the Natasha eyeshadow. So, sis, this Natasha palette, let me tell you, baby. Look, look, let me get you. Girl, I got to go to Louisiana on y'all because this just messed me up <laughs> all the way up because I would not buy it. I like the quality. You know how thick it is and heavy, okay? Now, um, let me be careful because I don't have a wristband on. So, this here retails um $48, okay? And you don't, you, um, this uh, ain't worth no $48. No way, Jose, near. All right, okay, so let's move on. I see Sherbert Primer. Let me tell you, I give this like a 10, a 100, because I really liked it. Even though I set my face with a powder, look guys, I went on a job interview, why? You know what I'm saying? That's what took me so long. I mean, I took my wrist band, I was like, I wanna be cute. I wanna be cute. You know, you ever get that feeling? So I was like, I didn't wanna tell y'all the secret before, you know, the secret, you know, but I'm, I'm having that interview and I'm telling y'all how the thing go. <laughs> I'll tell y'all more about that later but anyway so the icy sherbet this stuff is really let me tell you delicious focus on the honey focus on her not this cute face honey focus look i really fell in love with this stuff girl i mean it smells good it did not freaking irritate my skin and i'm like loving that like i like products that doesn't irritate my skin i don't like my skin to be itchy so i've had this makeup on all day and it is freaking like what time is it 
519 okay it's 519 girl i know i know <laughs> anyway so um yeah so this product is bomb i really would recommend this and i pretty much think i don't know i don't know what this do to all the type skin but i know if you're combination this will be perfect for you because that's exactly what i am combination girl i can only all in them t-zones so yeah this is a plus it's gonna be an everyday skate style a little lot stable and i'm just gonna like for real like i'm feeling this right now because the primer that i really love guys let's get back right 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 here all right so the primer that i love here um sherbet primer icy sherbet primer oh my god oh my god it is really good okay girl this stuff is good <laughs> i just love it okay i, I want to read this to y'all but i don't want to let the video be long so anyway so this here product retails for 32 dollars for me right now as of today it's worth 32 dollars i mean i'm it is now if you get in hiding it i wouldn't buy it but primer is always worth their dollars girl. don't you forget anyway keep it moving <laughs> okay so the dragon mascara where are you where are you because you're one of my favorites too let's see the dragon the Dragon Mascara, girl. Look at the details on that thing, girl. Look at that thing, girl. Oh my goodness, is that any like ideals in the front? No, it's just they just roll on it like regular, like. But yeah, you see. So anyway, I like this cute little thing or whatever. It's real cute, uh, girl. I can see myself going out to the club, <laughs> taking a mat. Uh, 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 uh yeah like i love this this is really cute i like dark stuff anyway so that um dragon mascara retails 18 dollars all right and last but not least all right the mama lisa tweezers okay whatever so anyway i ain't gonna cru i'm not gonna butcher nobody's name so i'm gonna show you what i'm talking about all right so this here the tweezers uh retails $18 I didn't use them because I got a lot of tweezers I already got I appreciate it if I said to him one son those tweezers and some me some more makeup brush that's something the girl I was using now you know tweezers last for years I don't know how much I mean how long y'all last but I think I tried these before and I think they're pretty good but tweezers are tweezers so anyway all tweezers work I mean it depends on how long they last, you know what I'm saying? Them look like they look like some expensive tweezers. But hell they are expensive tweezers. It's eight 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 dollars. If I say eighteen ninety nine. They are expensive, it's eighteen dollars. Eighteen dollars for tweezers? Good god am I. So anyway. <laughs> yeah so that brings me to the end of this video guys please do like share and subscribe if you guys like these videos i would like to see more of you guys and i would definitely like to hear from you guys more okay because y'all ain't been showing me no love like y'all ain't been showing me no love girl you know what i'm saying y'all like, like love me like subscribe love me and like love me and be like hey girl can you make a video like this like that you know i'm all for it girl i'm all for it it doesn't matter like let's talk let's talk like oh jeez what is that thing girl i'm trying to be cute and hmm, baby that girl's head baby girl, you don't need to be cute and you hurting <laughs> baby sometimes you gotta be like i'm hurting but i'm gonna still be cute anyway oh shoot lord jesus until way um yeah so i see y'all in the next video thank you so much for watching Mwah. i love you my father love you more be blessed till we see each other again bye guys